Hey, hey party people, I'm Zoe Hong and I want to show you how to create this cool gift idea. So it's fall here on Blueprint, which means it's party season and what host doesn't love it if you bring a great bottle of wine to their house and you can personalize it by creating one of these wine tags and I'm going to show you how. Personally, when I'm doing something like this, I like to make several in one go. So I like to create cutting templates so that I'm not measuring and cutting every single piece of paper over and over and over again, because that's tedious. And so I'm gonna paint this with some stripes today. We're going to set this aside and work on another step. So what we're gonna do now is we're going to paint this front card. I'm gonna take another sheet of paper. I'm going to take my front card template, which is cut out to be the right size. What I like to do is have a little fall motif like a pumpkin, or some leaves in this little corner here. And here's a little trick I like, is I like to wet the paper with just a little bit of clear water first. And then I will take my paint and I will dab it on, but because the paper is wet, it kind of moves and kind of gets blendy. We're gonna put our message up here. Now we're gonna start cutting out all our papers. I am cutting on a cutting mat. Do not cut up your mom's kitchen table, please. And take your back card template and go ahead and trace out your backdrop. Cover the part you want to protect and keep. And now you have your backdrop. This is my middle card template that I'm gonna to use to trace out. It really borders that front card really beautifully. So we have our three parts now. Front card, border card, and our backdrop. The way I measured these is so that I would have a quarter inch border around this card, and that I would have an eighth of an inch border around this card. So for these sorts of projects, I do like to use double stick tape. And then another thing I like to use is a dry adhesive where you have these sheets of little glue dots. And so what you wanna do is take your paper and lay it down on the bed of glue dots, firmly press, so that you're getting all that glue peel up and you can see all those glue dots. So now we are placing our front card on top of everything. You have some adhesive options and you can go ahead and use the dry adhesive again. I'm just gonna demo this step with the double stick tape. Hole punch. So choose whatever ribbon you like and you wanna cut the tip so that it's a nice point. Have nice fabric scissors around for this. So you want the sharp points so you can get it through the hole you just punched, really. Ta-da! And here is the final result. I think it turned out pretty nice. And that's the beauty of these kinds of projects is you get to really let your personality shine through. 
Be sure to check for more inspiration and cool project ideas right here on Blueprint.